going to start over. Uh, no, it's not a squirrel. What are they after? Oh, well. My dogs are idiots. I've mentioned that once before in a video or two. Anyway, a couple years ago, we planted King Belitises over here. And we also planted some other Belitises. Um, and I believe we're getting the... Uh, I believe what we have here is a King Belitis. We ate one this morning. Um, but you see the really thick stalk? That is uh, one of the signs of the King Belitis. Um, they, and this one's got a few bugs. We may be able to cut a piece out of that. Um, Maybe I'll cut a few pieces out of that. We'll see. <laughs> when the bugs get into them, they get into them. And we got another one right here. We, uh, he's a nice looking one. Uh, oh yeah, he's good. Yes. He's not. Ready. Yeah, he's not. Uh, Yay. They ain't got into him at all. Okay. Um, we picked one this morning and ate it. And uh, just kind of rummaging through we've gotten how many you got in your hand one two three four five six six and I got seven and we left a couple that were damaged um, over there we're gonna be looking to see if we can see any more in the area we planted them in and my wife is having a very good eye at this because she's gotten really into mushrooms <laughs> so da, 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 da. Don't see any, but we planted them all through this area. Uh, yes, my kudzu is take, trying to take over the world again. I'll have to get after it next year, but this year has been a little crazy. Don't think I see any. Um, anyway, um, we will be, we, like I said, we, kicked, we cooked one this morning that we had found, and uh, it was very good, very tasty. Um, not all, in our experience, if they... Even if they don't stain blue, some of them don't taste worth a flip. Um, but the one we did this morning was very, very good. So, uh, all right, I don't see any more. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, a couple of them. Yeah, all right. I know you don't miss me. No, no, no. All right. All right, I'm going to leave the little one there to grow. Unless you want me to get it so the... That's okay. Bugs don't get them, and I'll let him uh, also produce some. All right, so this is working very happy. Two years to wait for some uh, nice Belitises is not too long. Uh, this one could have a little damage. Nope. Nope. Nope, whatever got a hold of him just kind of messed him up, so. All right. They're after that dog. Yep. All right, I don't see any more. Although, so far today, my wife has proven the better eye. I've only found a couple of them. So, looks like it's about it. Um, guess what we're going to be? <laughs> we rehydrated a bunch of uh, oyster mushrooms today. We've been having problems with our well and weren't able to um, water our, our oysters to uh, get them to go again. Um, all right, so... This looks like what we got. We'll probably go ahead and do a little show on cooking these. And uh, the uh, oysters are going to end up in uh, lasagna and uh, maybe breakfast tomorrow. What do I see back there? I don't think it's. No, it's just some, just some odd colored leaves. All right. Well, anyway, we've left a couple to drop their spore and reproduce for us. So... Uh, and this is on our property, not on our logs, obviously. So, all right, I'm gonna go ahead and stop this and I'll do some, uh, I'll do it when we cook these this afternoon. Like I said, the one this morning we ate and my wife was like, let's find some more. <laughs> so now we have, all right, I'm gonna let you go. All right, we found a couple of more kings. Um, actually, I found these. My wife was finding them uh, much better than I was earlier. Um, I've got a king there, and I've got a, I believe this is a king here too, but I'm not quite sure. Let me feel underneath. No, that's one of those stupid fairy ring things that's a, that grows on our property all over. Uh, they're not really a edible. They, they look, from what I can tell, they're probably the one that they call a puker, 
and I'd rather not fool with that. <laughs> but there's another king right here. I think I'm going to leave him for another day and just pick these two. Um, and we have a lot of we have a lot of mushrooms today, even though our our uh, logs are kind of sort of out of it a little bit. I think I'm going to take this one here. Uh oh, that one could have got some bug damage. Maybe just the stem. The rest of the plant looks good. Let's make sure he doesn't stain blue when I do anything with him. No blue staining. So he is most likely the king. And uh, we also planted some up in our chicken pasture. Um, at the same time we planted these, or put these out, so probably need to take a really close look in some areas of my chicken pasture. And I'm also going to pick the uh, shiitake mushrooms that my wife found. Uh, so these will go into a different, uh, they may end up getting cooked the same time as the kings, I'm not really sure. Uh, we'll, we'll figure that out when we get inside. <laughs> Bye. All right, these are the bleeduses we uh, picked earlier. And uh, got a nice little bunch already cut up. And uh, these were planted in our Side these were planted the our, our yard around the um, where our uh, pine trees grow. And that's where you tested it. And that's where I tested it. Got it right in there. Right, a little bit of a thing that said that there's a one of the things I read said that uh, there's a uh, bleedus that looks like the king bleedus that isn't and uh, can make you sick and they said the gills will tend to stain a little blue or the uh, pores if you like mark it will tend to stain blue over time so uh, we went on ahead and uh, made confirmed that this was what we thought it was um, by that and uh, it's a pretty nice little batch of mushrooms um, some of them are buggy so We'll be, we're not doing much with the buggy ones. <laughs> well, these are pretty though. Yeah, they're real pretty. Nice looking. And uh, we See ate one here? this morning. Mm -hmm. We ate one this morning that was really good. Um, these also have a lot of uh, medicinal properties. I guess basically all mushrooms do, just about it. Um, or at least all the ones you can eat <laughs> do. And uh, we've eaten mushrooms a couple of times so far today. That one's a nice big one. The, I'm just going to uh, cut these off of it because most of them's got bugs in them. <laughs> yeah. Looks pretty good. Mm-hmm. Yep, looks pretty good. And these are wow. a Belitis mushroom. Um, they don't nice. have gills, they have pores, and uh, you can, if I get close, see the pores on some of them, others not so much, um, but uh, they drop their, their pore, they, they drop their spores from the pores there, kind of get a look at the, oops, let me have a little piece of that one, all right, that's the, the, that's the pores, like gills on other mushrooms there, and then the white flesh is what you eat. And uh, I actually eat the whole thing, but uh, they're uh, they're quite good. We've uh, I'm really happy that they came up from a couple of years ago. <laughs> it was a pleasant was, surprise. It was a very pleasant surprise, especially today as we found so many. Um, the one we ate this morning was really good, and I then we found a whole bunch more <laughs> a little later in the morning. So. Uh, we're gonna be, we're gonna be mushrooming out, <laughs> which we've kind of been doing that this this whole year since the the yeah. uh, oyster stuff uh, started. I got a stew over there started from when we we're doing the oyster mushrooms earlier, and I've already the lasagna is done. It's in the oven. Come look at it. Yeah, that's got mushrooms in it. Tried mushrooms. We got mushrooms. That we oyster mushrooms left for breakfast in the morning. Yep, we got some oysters for the so. for breakfast in the morning. 
and uh, we are doing good. Our our oysters are probably going to put on another flush here in the next little bit. I was looking at them this morning. They're uh, they're getting ready to do another flush. Maybe it'll be a great big flush. I don't know yet. They the last flush because we had problems getting keeping water on them. The last flush was uh, kind of a minor kind of a minor flush. It wasn't a big flush. Um, which didn't really hurt anything. Okay. So. Mm. Cut a little bit of it off right there. Yeah, I was going to say, you might want to cut that corner over there off. I'm looking for buggy boos. I don't enjoy eating buggy boos, so. <laughs> Anybody who's ever camped much knows they've eaten at least a few bugs. <laughs> or ridden motorcycles, or rode bicycles without a helmet, or, you know, pretty much anything of that nature. <laughs> We're doing pretty good here. Yeah, those look good. And there's a good chance we'll get some more in the, possibly even tomorrow. Um, we just have to figure it out whether we want to, whether we want to do some more or whether we want to let them uh, drop their spores and get some later on in the year. Um, we are nice leaving, too. we are leaving some to do the spores. That's a big pretty one there. It's nice on the bottom too. Yeah, that's a big pretty one there. And the King Belitis has a kind of a a bigger stalk, um, big cap head. I guess they call the in yeah, big nice big stalk. Uh, they got a, they go by a bunch of different names. Um, the one I found the most interesting was uh, in England. They're called the Penny Bun because um, they look like a a bun, I guess. <laughs> when we're out there. That looks good. Yeah, it looks real good. We're going to have a lot of mushrooms. Yes, we are. We've already eaten a lot of mushrooms today. And we're we going to eat more. We think we a few. <laughs> we're going to eat more. I don't mind drying them, that's for sure. No. And we can dry these also. So if we get a nice flush that, uh, another nice flush, you know, in the next little bit, um, we get a bunch. I actually kind of suspect if we'd have had some rain this year, we'd have uh, had these earlier in the year, just based on what I know about them. Yeah, so. we've been watering those logs over there lately. Yeah, we've had to water our logs to get to, to get mushrooms on them by and large. Um, With a soaker hose, guys. <laughs> yeah, drip, drape a soaker hose over it and let it soak. All right, I'm probably going to stop and uh, let her finish up what she wants and then we'll uh, do it while we're cooking some you now could go get some uh, 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 Seminole pumpkins some of the small Seminole pumpkins and saute them up oh, with that those. would be nice too <laughs> might have to do that <laughs> got the onions or scallions to go with it uh, out in the garden we do right. yeah and go get Ooh. some scallions uh oh found a that bad one pretty rough that one's bad yeah yeah the bugs you got into them yeah you got enough. I think I'd. I think I'd leave the buggy. I'll let ones. the buggies have that one. Yeah, I'll take I'll the. Share. I'll take the caps out and go put them on the. Yeah, I'll <laughs> share. Yeah. Didn't even I'll cut take, that one open. See. Yeah, I'll take the caps out and I'll put them out on out there so they, the spores can drop out there, uh, around the area where we got these That's plus some nice other one. areas around. Yep, it's another pretty one. Uh, got a few little. Oh, it's all in the top. There he is. Yeah. That's the one thing about these. You got to get them, or else the bugs are going to get them. Yeah. That's that's. Cut them, cut them around, the, cut around there, and see if he's. I know what he, what he is. Looks like. I can tell. Yep, he's already. I can tell on that one. Yeah, we'll take these out and dump the, uh, dump them pour side down so they can. Uh, see. Yeah. I cut them in half. I cut them. No, they ain't gonna bother. Nope. Got too many. You ain't gonna worry with it, I are know. you? I know. I know what happens. Got so many, you ain't even going to worry with it. <laughs> I got enough right here, and I'm happy with what I got. I am not going to be stingy. <laughs> we'll go put these and have some more out there. Yep. I'll go put, put them gill side down and make sure they put them in some areas where they, we didn't pick any from. And He's the one that does the planting are. in the family, so <laughs> he knows what he's doing. All right. There you go, dear. All right. I'll go ahead and turn this off.